You know, often, whether it's in literature or in song or in cinema, love, love is often the theme of the piece of literature, the movie you're watching, or the song that you're singing. Remember that song, What is Love? Well, you know what? The Bible actually defines it. Let me read it to you. Paul says in 1 Corinthians 13 that love is patient, kind. Love's not jealous or boastful or proud or rude. It does not demand its own way. It's not irritable. It keeps no record of being wrong. It doesn't rejoice about injustice, but rejoices whenever the truth wins out. Love never gives up, never loses faith, is always hopeful, and endures every circumstance. You know who that sounds like to me? Love sounds a lot like Jesus. That's exactly who Jesus was on earth and is today. Love is best described and defined in Jesus. Those of us who have been changed by Jesus and have the Holy Spirit living in us and empowering us to live a life of love, well, you see, it's a lot more about motion than it is emotion. See, love is kind. See, that's emotion. That, that's thing that you, you do. There, there's something tactile to that. Love is patient. Patience isn't an emotion you feel, it's something you practice. So today, I want to encourage you, be loving to those around you. How? Make a choice to be patient, to be kind, to keep no record of wrong, to be one who hopes for the best and believes the best in those whom are in your life. See, God truly is love, and He's manifested that perfectly in His Son, Jesus. And today, I want to encourage you to live your best day possible. You can do that by choosing to love God and all those around you today.